Hi guys and welcome back to a new video. So in today's video I will go through all my sales for uh, the past month but um, as I haven't really been playing a lot as you can see here I was missing a lot of days it's actually just from the past two weeks uh, in reality. So I will go through all of that and I will see uh, what are the interesting items and what is currently selling. So let's start uh, with some glorious set, a disgusting Ozling, so that's pretty good. Um, we also have here, this is a uh, WOD BOE that I bought for 1k if I remember and sold after 2 days, so it's pretty good. A plundered blade of Norfolkins, a really really great item to have up on your auction house. Uh, some enchanted elementium bar, uh, we also have a swift uh, spring strider, a good mount to, to sell. Uh, another blade, um, oh that's very interesting, so these mounts I talked about in the previous video and I bought them on average for uh, 20k, not even 20k, I think uh, 15k and yeah they are now selling for a lot because less people are posting these uh, mounts on the auction house, so really really happy about this. Then we have uh, First Mate Hat, it's a uh, world drop BOE from Vanilla. Uh, two reigns of the tame blood fister again these mounts I bought them uh, probably one month ago for around 12k on average and yeah there are no selling for 66k so it's really really great a huge profit I also have a sealed tomb of the lost legion archaic defender a nice um, weapon then there is the reigns of the tame blood fister uh, another mount, that's really great. Uh, Julius Jovial Drape, uh, that's a uh, world BOE from uh, BFA. Then we have a Firekin Amex, that's uh, the, the BOE from the Island Expedition. And yeah, again, I really recommend you to uh, try to get this set if it's cheap on your auction house because these sets are selling for a lot. Uh, then we have a more enchanted element and bar, a orb of deception, that's pretty great. Uh, jade black plates, so that's great as well, more glorious uh, pieces. Um, and after that I think that's it, so let's already get this uh, 880k gold. And let's see what I sold uh, after that. Oh and yeah, also you will see uh, just after I actually screwed up <laughs> big big time, uh, I will show you why but uh, yeah, that's uh, lessons learned for when you're not really paying attention and you're posting your items, uh, you can end up making uh, huge mistakes, so let's see, oh okay, wait, actually, oh okay, actually it already uh, took everything, so let me check just here what I was talking about, so as you can see I have uh, more uh, cells and one of them is the Tibu's Blazing Longsword for 18k. So as you might know this sword is um, the one that you can drop from Vanilla bio, um, uh, Farms and it's really really rare and on average it's probably selling for 400k. And yeah, I just uh, got confused, I don't know why I posted it for 20k and it sold probably like in a few seconds, so yeah, that's uh, really really bad because I lost a lot of gold and actually yeah, I spent a lot of time trying to get this item, so yeah, that's uh, that's okay though, but uh, yeah. So then I sold one stealing adventure hat, this is something that you can craft with uh, lever working, it's really great, Hope Hander, uh, World BOE uh, from that's a drop from uh, Kazakh uh, in uh, BC, it's really great as well. Uh, then I have a spiked terrorware grid boots, so that's the BOEs from Tombs of Sargeras. And then these uh, with guards of the Dark Keepers is also a BOE from Enters. These BOEs are selling really really well, so I always recommend you to uh, try to you know farm uh, these for sure. Then, um, yeah, this um, shoulder parts, pretty great. So, for now, we had 1,167k gold, 
and then we still have uh, one range of the thundering ruby cloud serpent again nice one to sell another blade um, and then a minion of grampus that's really great bought it for i think 40k a couple of months ago so really happy, happy about that and yeah i think that's it so in total it's around 1 million uh four so really happy about uh, that i think one million four uh for the past two weeks is really great um i'm happy because with uh, the sh release of shadowlands more and more people are going to play and more and more uh, people are going to buy um all these different items and also right now i still have uh 36 millions worth of gold up on my auction house uh so yeah it means that i still have a lot of things uh, to sell for sure so yeah, I think it was pretty good. Uh, again, I'm really sad about selling the Tibu's blade for 20k. I mean, that's uh, a huge mistake, but uh, it happens, unfortunately. I would just highly recommend you when you are uh, posting your items to always, always be careful because it can, you know, usually happens. For instance, if someone is posting an item with a very, very low price, sometimes, you know, TSM would just, you know, put it uh, with one gold less and you will just end up uh, losing a lot of gold so always be careful uh, with that guys and yeah other than that uh, I don't think I have anything else to add um, really happy about sharing all these tips with you and yeah I hope you like this video I really hope that all the different tips I gave you um, will help you make some gold and yeah um, if you like the video please subscribe it's always great it will help me uh, grow uh, this channel and maybe focus a little bit more on making more videos but yeah guys um, other than that just wishing you a happy end of the day and yeah we'll see you in the next video bye